Hello everyone, I hope you are doing really well. Um, ouchie. I am trying to kill two birds with one stone today and sort my life out and make some content. But yesterday I got sent my PO box. Ugh. I'm very strong and I'm finding it quite difficult to lift this. It is the biggest like bag full of new inner beauty products. And I thought today I would basically unbox it and go through some of the new beauty launches with you. I used to do these videos all the time, haven't in ages, but I'm literally surrounded by like press releases and boxes of stuff that I need to open and sort out. So I thought, yeah, I'd show you. At the same time, I kind of like watching these videos myself, so just in case some of you do, I haven't had a look in this box yet, so it's going to be a complete surprise. I would like to say before I get into this video, unfortunately, a lot of these samples and press releases come with an awful lot of excess packaging, which I'm really unhappy about. It makes me really sad to see so much like um, waste that goes towards sending um, bloggers and youtubers products. I am going to do my best to recycle as much as I can from this video But it, unfortunately it does happen. I would also like to say I'm not being paid to make this content and no brand has asked me to make this video Right, this is from Benefit and it's the find your perfect mascara match Oh, they've sent all three of their mascaras bad girl bang roller lash and they're real bad girl bang Fun fact, is my all-time favourite mascara. It has taken me a very long time to find mascara, like my holy grail, but this one just ticks all the boxes. The wand is just incredible. It really volumises my lashes without making them heavy or clumpy. It combs through really nicely. The only thing I'd say isn't amazing about it is it does sometimes leave like a little bit of a mark that I have to wipe off in the day. Like, it transfers, but it's 100% worth it, so I'm really happy that they sent another one of those. I haven't actually tried the other two in a while, so maybe I can do a comparison blog post. Let me know if you'd like to see that, like comparing all of them to see the different effects they give. Charlotte Tilbury, Pillow Talk. Oh, honestly feel like the luckiest girl in the world right now. Charlotte Tilbury have very kindly sent me two of everything in the Pillow Talk range. So we've got two of the Luxury Palette eyeshadow quads. So stunning, the most beautiful shades. Two of the Lip Cheek um, lip liners in the shade Pillow Talk, which honestly has a cult following. It's such a beautiful My Lips But Better shade. Two of their legendary Pillow Talk lipsticks and also two of the Pillow Talk blushes. I am gonna be giving away one full set of this over on my Instagram. So if you would like to enter that, keep an eye out, go and follow me on Instagram. I'll leave a link to it down below. But how gorgeous is that? They're so generous to have sent me all of those products. I'm really looking forward to giving you guys the chance to win a set of those. Got some lovely bits from Estee Lauder, which, oh, I could pinch myself. Makes me feel so lucky. Oh, they've sent my exact color in double wear which is amazing as I've nearly finished mine now. Those of people ask me this when I use this in my tutorials, I'm the shade 1NO porcelain. They've also sent a double wear powder foundation which I haven't tried before. Looks like this, I'm definitely going to give that a go. And they've sent their double wear instant fix concealer. Cool! What is on the other side? What is that? Hydrate Prep. So it's got a primer on one end and a concealer on the other. I'm definitely gonna put this in my makeup bag straight away. I have this bag and it has a cream egg in it. We know you're a big Cadbury fan. Yes, I am. So we thought we'd send you your very own rare white chocolate cream egg to enjoy. Oh my God, a white chocolate. I can't have this now. It is literally breakfast time, but look. A white chocolate cream egg. I'm gonna enjoy that later. Oh, thank you Cadbury's. I always love receiving chocolate in my PO box. They've still got that competition on this year, I think, where if you find the um, white egg, you win a prize or something. So yeah, keep an eye out in store. I've been to Caves at the Naked Reloaded palette. Oh, I feel so lucky. Oh my god, this is beautiful. This is like cushioned. So Urban Decay recently got rid of their Naked Original palette, which was really sad. It's such a well-loved, iconic cult product, especially from like the golden old days of blogging. But they've remade it and these are all the new colours in it. I think this is gorgeous, really wearable. A nice mix of mattes and shimmers, warm toned eyeshadows 
for everyday use. Can't wait to give that a go. <laughs> oh my god, this bag, I'm literally gonna have to get in it. The best thing for, would be for me to just pour it all on my bed. This has come from Pixie. It is a massive box with an incredible, humongous version of their Glow Tonic with a pump as well and some cotton pads. That is adorable. Glow Tonic is great, um, a liquid exfoliator which helps to promote glowing skin and help clear your skin as well. I always find it's alcohol free, gently exfoliates and brightens for all skin types. If you haven't tried Glow Tonic, I would definitely recommend it. If your skin's looking a bit dull, it will really help to brighten and kind of remove that top layer of dead skin. And they've also launched a couple of really gorgeous eyeshadow palettes which I think look beautiful. I'll put some close-ups here. If you'd like to see some tutorials or swatches of this, let me know down below. Saint Tropez have a new product out. I'm really excited about trying this. This is the Purity Self Tan Bronzing Gel Water. It's literally clear, so you have to be a bit of a fake tan pro, I think, to try this out. Um, but it has a tropical scent and you get a natural looking glow in three hours and they've promised no transfer on clothes so they've sent a white t-shirt out as well so I can give it a full try. It says a weightless non-sticky gel that transforms into a clear water upon contact with the skin for instant absorption, immediate hydration and a natural looking golden depth of tan. No need to rinse off meaning you can wear it with your favourite clothes and have no streaks. If you don't believe us, go ahead and try it. So I'm really looking to, forward to giving that a go. <gasps> I know what this is straight away. This is from Bondara. How exciting. Bondara is one of my favourite sex toy websites. I was not expecting some sex toys in this PO box. I thought it was going to be purely beauty stuff. <gasps> Oh my god, toys! Oh my god, I'm so excited. I totally wasn't expecting this. Okay, let's have a look. Nice. Calm down. I thought I was literally just going to be talking about lipsticks, but I'm talking about a G-spot silicone dildo in this video. This is taking a turn. This looks really lovely. It's so soft. It looks like it will get right up on the G-spot. And it also has some ridges down the side as well, which I think will feel great. What looks like a butt plug. I've never ever used a butt plug before. Oh my god that is adorable. I'm opening it. It's a butt plug but with like a red ruby diamond heart thing on the bot bottom but this is very cute. Mm -mm. They have sent a rose gold bullet vibrator. I've got a couple of these already and they're amazing. Got some toy cleaner. That's so good, toy cleaner. I normally have to do like the walk of shame to the bathroom to clean my toys after I use them and just pray that none of my housemates are in the hallway. So yeah, this is great. Also some luxury lubricant, nice. And, <gasps> oh my God, I've always wanted one of these. Oh my god, it's a Bondara massage wand. Um, these are supposed to be absolutely incredible and you don't just have to use it for sex, you can use it for massaging your back, your partner. I think it's just one like vibration, but it sounds like you can make it more intense. Very exciting, I cannot wait to give this a go. I will report back if you would like to hear about that. Wowza, this is brilliant, Ciate have released a Jessica Rabbit makeup collection. Jessica Rabbit, such a babe. What an absolute dream of a cartoon character. Who framed Roger Rabbit? I need to rewatch that soon. Oh, look at this packaging. Oh, that is gorgeous. Ciate always blow me away with their makeup collections. Like, I love their highlighters. Their eyeshadows are beautiful. Their glitter flip lipsticks are stunning. And this is so Jessica Rabbit with those gorgeous purple shades um, and some nudes as well. There's also a highlighter. This highlighter is called Roger Darling. Oh nice. But a gorgeous natural highlighter. And there's also a lipstick which I want to see the packaging of. Oh. Your shimmer. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh, almost looks like velvet that lipstick with a shimmer so gorgeous. I am getting a backache. One of my favourite skincare brands, Ula Enriksen, have sent a couple of their products that I've been using, so this is great because now I have some backups. The Banana Bright Eye Cream, which is just incredible. I've been using morning and evening recently around my eye area. They've sent the Cold Plunge Pore Mask, haven't tried this, 
deeply purifies pores and reduces oil with clay and snow lotus extract and the sea rush brightening gel cream a really nice kind of light whipped sorbet moisturizer to keep your skin nice and youthful and radiant lipstick queen have sent some of their new lip products they've got rearview mirror lip products which i'm guessing is like a metallic liquid lipstick and then also some of their altered universe lipsticks let's have a look at these so review mirror this is the shade little nude coupe oh cool it's not liquid it's a pen hmm that's nice i've just put a little bit in the center of my lips which has kind of given a fuller dimension to them that feels nice really moisturizing love the packaging as well and that comes in a couple of shades We've got a gorgeous like orange red there and then i'm interested about these ones the the altered universe ah oh, oh wow that is so pretty really sparkly holographic lip gloss i haven't tried much of this brand before but um, I've always been intrigued by them because their lip products look amazing. This is from L'Oreal. It says coffee just got sweeter, wake up your skin. I'm guessing it's coffee scrub. Yeah, L'Oreal Paris smooth sugars wake up scrub. Ah! Hotel chocolate chocolates. Oh my god, this is adorable. Oh, that is so cute. A little coffee mug and also to grow coffee cup. This eco cup contains special growing media and seeds, plus an extra seed bag in case your first growing attempt fails. Oh cool, you can grow, you can literally, you can grow your own plants. I'm definitely going to try that out. I haven't used this yet, but I will do. Bare Minerals have sent a super, super sized version of their Complexion Rescue. This is one of my favourite BB creams for really light but buildable coverage. I am in the shade Opal and it's now available in a bigger size, 70ml. So they've really kindly sent this. This is double the usual size of their normal ones. So if you're a fan, it might be more worth doing getting a bigger one. I've got to show you guys this. This is L'Oreal Earl Net Satin, but it has, it's like limited edition and it's got like glitter in it it's very subtle but it keeps your hair like held but also has tiny specks of like glitter i think this is absolutely beautiful it's enriched with micro light reflectors so it captures the light for a gorgeous shine maybelline have sent a couple of their tattoo brow waterproof gels i've always wanted to try these let me know if you'd like a video of this as well up to two days hold pigment in your eyebrows sounds amazing i've also got a couple of bits from givenchy we have some rouge interdit limited edition satin lipsticks oh the packaging is just gorgeous looks like this this is the shade 13 and it's super beautiful very luxurious this if you if you have a bit more of a budget and you want to treat yourself to a nice luxurious lipstick then I think these are definitely ones to go for. I've been sent a book. I always love receiving books in my PO box. This is called Misogyny Nation, The True Scale of Sexism by Laura Bates. 100 years since some women were first given the right to vote, we are still struggling to get to groups with the true extent of the gender equality that continues to flourish in our society. Drawing attention to sexism everywhere, Bates uncovers the discrimination in our relationships, our workplaces, our homes, our media, at our schools and on our streets. I will leave a link to that down below if that sounds like something you would be interested in reading. And um, It's Cosmetics have sent a little gift for International Women's Day. They've sent two boxes of everything so I can share it with someone special and influential woman in my life, which is definitely either gonna be my mum or sister because they deserve a bit of a treat. They've sent two of the All Day Waterproof Lip Liner Stain in It Girl, which is a classic red shade. Got two of the It Girl lipsticks as well, very iconic. Two of the Universal Taupe brow powders make my mum a very happy girl, I think. These meringues are a little bit crushed now though. <laughs> Meringue all over my bed. Marc Jacobs have a new mascara out and I've been sent this cute little box for it. They've got an Epic Lash Primer, which I haven't tried yet. Oh wow, it's like nude. It does look like an eye primer kind of formula. And then they've also got their Velvet Noir 
volume mascara which is actually another one of my favorite mascaras i have tried this before i've been through quite a couple of these actually so i'm interested to see how that works with the primer underneath it you might have seen this in a vlog recently but bare minerals have released 20 new long wear lipsticks in their bare pro range oh, i've worn the shade cherry already and it's absolutely stunning but I do want to do either a full video or a full blog post with swatches of all of these. When I went on the Bare Minerals event last year, was it last year? The end of last year? I interviewed Rosie Huntington Whiteley, who's like a supermodel, absolutely amazing woman. And one of her favourites is the shade Cherry as well. So if you want to see that vlog, I'll leave that down below. Right, next up we have this humongous box. This is from LMA. Is it LMA or LMS? I never quite know. This is the Pro Collagen Capsule Collection, the day to night edit for younger looking skin. And it contains, by the looks of it, three products a Pro Collagen Advanced Eye Treatment, an Overnight Matrix Night Cream and a day cream. You guys know that I suffer with acne, I have done in the past, and I'm really um, cautious about like trying pr new products out. As you can imagine, I get sent an awful lot of skincare, um, and I'm always so scared to try them in case they give me spots. So where I can, I try to be a bit cautious of um, not trying to try too many new products all at once. Oh my god, this is adorable, it comes in a little box. How cute is that? This is a really nice gift, I think, especially for Mother's Day, perhaps if your mum likes a bit of skincare. I will leave links to everything down below. I have just turned 30. I say just turned 30. I turned 30 like six months ago. So I am worried at the moment about wrinkles and fine lines. And I'm not that sure I ever want to do Botox or fillers. I'd like, I prefer to be au natural. So I'd like to start like preventing those issues with skincare now whilst I still can. Elemis have also kindly sent some of their new superfood skincare range which looks like I've just been to the green grocers and picked up some fruit and veg. Awful lot of packaging I have got to say here. They've got the superfood berry boost mask. Loads of people have been talking about this over on their Insta stories recently so I'm looking forward to giving it a go. A purifying prebiotic purple mask. Leave skin, skin looking clear and bright. This sounds great there's also a veggie mask for super bright skin a black currant jelly exfoliator for smooth skin and a kefir tree mist for dewy skin what is this lights for fun it is a bell jar oh it looks like it's barry m wait what is this barry m have sent a bell jar with some fairy lights in with their radiance serum beauty elixir is this skincare then I didn't know Barry M were doing skincare, or at least an oil. Revitalise and soothe skin with this ultra light, fast absorbing face serum. Try it on the back of my hand. Mmm, smells like oranges. That's nice. It hasn't left my skin greasy at all. So yeah, I'd be interested in trying that. And gotta love a bell jar. So adorable! And then the final thing I wanted to show you is from. Fenty Beauty. They very, very kindly sent me a couple of bits. First up, some of their new highlighters. These are the Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighters. They've sent me two shades. The first is called Water Brat. This packaging is so lovely. And it looks like this. It's a really gorgeous iridescent pink, almost like, yeah, like baby Barbie pink highlighter and then there's also one called chills which is very similar but a blue which is going to leave you with the most gorgeous iridescent kind of like ice queen vibes highlight and they sent me this which i'm like freaking out about <laughs> it's just amazing it's like a makeup kit so they've sent a couple of different shades of their pro filter soft matte longwear foundation and their instant retouch concealer very sadly these aren't in my shades but that's fine because i wanted to go out and buy myself my own shade in it anyway and um, yeah how gorgeous is that and then they've also sent some brushes and powders on the other side i just feel like yeah live i'm living the dream right now thank you so much fenty that is everything i wanted to show you this is a mammoth video but i hope you found some new products that you'd potentially like to go out and try do go over to my instagram where i'm going to be giving away that charlotte tilbury pillow talk set of products very excited about that i'll leave links to everything i've spoken about down below and i will see you next week in my weekly vlog Mwah!